All right, what's going on guys? It's your boy Zilchi. Welcome back to another Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel video. And in today's video, we'll be taking a look at the new Sky Striker. All right, we got some buffs with the Sky Striker. Shout out to homie Slick for giving us these replays in Diamond Rank. Uh, so we're going to be able to take a look at how strong this deck actually became. He's Diamond Rank 1 and he was able to go on quite a win streak with this deck, right? So let's take a look at it. If you guys do enjoy this video hit that like button comment share subscribe i'm gonna have the deck list in the description below like always and yeah let me know in the comments how you guys feel about this deck if you guys feel like it's a really top tier deck or if you feel like it needs to be stronger or you know just overall how you feel about the deck but again let's just hop straight into it all right so we are going second here i believe this duel is against despia but we'll take a look what happens i'm pretty sure in this one that he does break unfortunately He's gonna try to use the Alibur. Obviously, he can't get his effect off. We have Effect Baylor. But he does have an Ash. For uh counterplay to what we're about to do. So we're gonna activate on our turn. We're gonna try to use Engage. Engage is really good. It allows you to grab a Sky Striker card from the deck to your hand, right? You can control no monsters. He's gonna try to ash it, but we have called by the graves, so we are A-OK. -okay. Perfect. Those are my fingers, by the way. Top tier. <laughs> Anyways, better resolves. Let's read this card. I'm pretty sure this is the new card. The Linkage. If you control no monsters in your main monster zone, you cannot special summon monsters from the extra deck for the rest of this turn, except for Sky Strikers monsters, right? So it says send one card you control to the graveyard and if you do special summon one sky striker ace monster from your extra deck to the extra zone and if you have at least one light and one dark sky striker monster on your field it gains 1000 attack this card is really good and it sets up a really uh nice board for uh otking going second and trying to dodge effects right so like this this card is really good we'll, we'll look at how he uses it this turn right we're going to go into the Raven attack here. So we're going to activate Ray's effect. Go to the graveyard. We're going to special summon a monster from the extra deck. We're going to get into the Hayate. Hayate activates sending a card. This is the Rose. We're going to activate the linkage here. Then we go into the Kagari. Kagari is at 2 now, by the way. This is going to activate to bring back a spell card. So we're going to bring back the uh, linkage. Then we activate the linkage again. And then we attack for game here. Really good card. The linkage. And I'm pretty sure there's another card that came out. But I can't remember. But it's really, really good. And it does make this deck viable. The combo seemed like it only worked because the opponent had nothing. But we're going to take a look at another duel to showcase you guys exactly why this combo or these cards are actually so good. So we're going to go ahead and go to the next one. Which is against Sword Soul. Full board. Okay. All right, and again, we are going second. So for both of these zoo, we do go second here. Slick showcasing exactly why Sky Strikers is now considered one of the top tier decks in this game. I'm going to try to veil it the Moe. Fortunately, he did have the Call by the Grave. So we couldn't really stop it. And we have nothing else to kind of interrupt his plays this turn on his turn, right? So he's going to be able to just pop off. At this point, Moyi gets a token on the field. He's gonna go into a level eight, which is the Shishao. Shishao activates chaining one, chaining two. Just in case we had an uh, Ash, right? And then this adds Sword Soul, or Sword Soul monster to the hand. He's gonna go into the Long Yuan, get his token on the field by tripling a card from his hand. Perfect. He goes into Baron the Filler. Right now, you'd think this is pretty good, right? Like, he's about to end his turn. He probably has a blackout in hand because most Sword Soul deck just end on this. But he has a little bit of a twist right here. It makes it even harder for us. Fusion Destiny. He opened up so good, this player. Like, if you have this field, let's be honest here. You're probably going to win the duel, right? But unfortunately for him, we opened up really good as well. We're able to play through a bunch of negates and a destruction okay so let's take a look at it the harpy's feather duster we have we have the anchor 
We'll just activate this. Let's see if he negates. He does not. So, get rid of the Imperm. Now we're going to activate Catch Up and Maneuver. He's going to attempt to negate. We have the Anchor. But he does have DPE. Which DPE can pop the Baron de Fleur to uh, negate that effect. But it really doesn't matter. Right? Perfect. Baron does negate this. Now we activate the Engage. We're going to... Activate both of these, actually. He just chained this, so Engage is going to add a card to his hand, and he's going to activate the Linkage to go into a Link Monster and combo from there. Really good. Now we're going to grab another Anchor. He went into Hayate. Uh, but let's take a look at what Hayate does. He can Special Summon, Sky Striker, Hayate once per turn. This card can attack directly. At the damage calculation, if this card battled you can send one sky striker card from your deck to the graveyard he's probably going to send the rose or a spell card right so let's see let's see we have anchor which can allow us to bring a card to our side of the field so let's see activate it we're going to grab this he's going to negate the hayate which is fine a-okay now we battle Destroy DPE, but DPE gets his effect. Attack. This is negated. We're going to link off into the Zeke. Link again into the Kagari. We're going to activate Kagari here. Grabbing the Engage. Activate Engage to grab a card to the hand, which is going to be the... I can't say this name, but this card is also really good. We'll take a look at it in a second. So, once per turn, you can target one other card you control, send that card to the graveyard. Opponent cannot activate cards or effects in response to your spell card activation for the rest of the turn. Set Sky Striker spells with different names from your graveyard, up to the number of Sky Striker spell cards you activated this turn while this card was faced up on the field. So, really good, really good card. Shizuku is going to activate here, we're going to grab it. We're going to activate this card and then he's going to scoop up. He has nothing in hand to play through what we had on field. So yeah, this deck is really, really good, really fun. Uh, if you guys want to use it, I'm going to have it in the description below. Like I said, let me know in the comments how you guys feel about it. If you guys feel like it's tier one, tier two, tier three, it's definitely in the tiers now, right? At first it was rogue, but now it's definitely up there with these new cards. Uh, really strong deck now. So yeah, let me know how you guys feel. I'm going to have it in the description. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.